course, uh, a little bit more after that. Uh, hello, I'm Sean Cheek, and welcome to Easy Piano Lessons. You can contact me by sending me an email to easypianolessons at yahoo.com. The website is www.webpianoteacher.com. And this song is by special request uh, from Paul. And uh, it is uh, a song by Fats Waller uh, from a video from 1943. And it's called Ain't Misbehaving. There's lots of versions, but I decided to do this one. Uh, <clears throat> and let's start with an E octave on the right hand. And uh, he may be playing this song in E flat uh, some other times, but on this recording it's in E. And it, it may be because the recording is sharp uh, in pitch, but anyway, I did it in the, the, the uh, key it sounded like. So we have E here on the right hand, E, and then E on the pinky that makes an E octave, uh, pretty high uh, together. Then we're going to have a single G by itself, and then a G sharp, and then a B after that. And the rhythm for that little part there is. So, bum, ba, bum, bum. And then we're going to have E flat octave, E flat on the thumb, E flat on the pinky, with a G and a B flat in the middle. So G and B flat all together, four notes. And then we're going to keep the B flat and the G and change the octave part to D flat. So D flat, G, B flat, D flat. Okay? So that first box goes. spread out for those octaves or you can't do it so um, and then continuing on we have B C sharp E and B for the right hand and then we're going to keep the E and the C sharp in the middle and change the octave part to A's so so from the beginning all right I just went that far and then a single E and then Right here, what you can do when you have two white notes together and you have a big chord is you can play both notes with your thumb. So I'm playing the A and the B with my thumb, and then the D sharp and the G sharp with that. And then I'm just changing the G sharp to an F sharp and keeping the rest of it. So from the beginning, okay, and then we have E, G sharp, B, E. E, G sharp, B, E all together. Alright, then we have this. Da -da 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 -da. So G sharp, A, A sharp, B, then A natural, G, F sharp, right there, and then we come up here, E, and then B to C really fast. I wrote a curved line because it's kind of a grace note, the B is. So B to C, and then back to B. So right here. sharp and G together. Okay? And then we have G sharp, B, and E together. Bum, bum. So over there it's da -da 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 -da. And then the singing starts and then the uh, piano accompaniment. Now left hand, here we have G sharp, B, E all together. And then we're going to have G, B flat, C sharp. Okay, so sorry for all the flats and sharps, but uh, you know this kind of uh, music back then had lots of uh, diminished chords, so we have lots of flats and sharps. And then after that, we're going to have uh, B flat, C sharp, E and G together. B flat, C sharp, E and G. So you know those first three chords are. And then we have a low F sharp here, down here with the pinky. And then come up to the middle of the piano for F sharp, A, C sharp, E all together. Right there. And then down to a B. And then we're going to come up for F sharp, A, B, and D sharp. Kind of reminds you of ragtime music. The up and down motion. But here I'm just playing one note instead of an octave. And then B. And then F sharp, A, B, D sharp together. And then here we just have E, G sharp, B all together. All right. I didn't write the left hand here, but all it is is octaves with the right hand. So play the same thing the right hand's doing, starting with that G sharp. And then, okay, and then, then the uh, left hand's going to do its own thing after that. But uh, let's put hands together that far. So here from the beginning, here's the first box. So this is all together. So just 
Did the right hand there. Now this is together. Then the right hand's by itself, and then the left hand's by itself. So, I'm sorry. Alright, it's hard to reach over here, but let me try it again. Alright, then this is together. Then right hand's by itself. Then left hand's by itself. And then right hand by itself. And then together here. Together here. Or just right hand. And then just left. And then together here. And then octaves. Alright, so again, again from the beginning. place here. I've got to hurry up because we're going to run out of time. Let me just show you the chords. G sharp B E and then G sharp B C sharp E and then A C sharp F sharp and then A B D sharp F sharp and then G sharp B E and then G sharp B D E and then A C sharp E and then F sharp A C E. Okay? And then these chords are, uh, let's see, that is, oh, well, that's wrong there, hold on. Oh, okay, I had to change a note here. We have G flat, A flat, C, E flat, and then we have E, G sharp, B, C sharp. And then we have F sharp, A, C sharp, E, and then we have F sharp, A, C, D sharp, F sharp, A, C, D sharp. Okay, so those are the chords. We're going to play each chord two times. One, two, one, two, so forth. Left hand uh, is on an E, down to C sharp. Actually, we're going to do an octave, E, and then we're going to play the high E on the second chord. So each chord plays twice in the right hand. The first chord is the low note, and the second chord will be the thumb note. So it's one, two, one, two, like that. You play the second one really short. Uh, so E, C sharp, F sharp octave, and then a B octave, and then you see the E's there, and the A's, and here we have uh, A flat, and then C sharp, and then F sharp, and then B. Okay, and we play each chord two times. So let me go through it how it goes. Here's where the singing starts. Now in the second box. Sign. Okay, I just did these two boxes. Now come back and do this one box. Hey, misbehaving, saving all my love. Oh, you now we just repeated this box. Now go here. Oh, you. Okay, then after we do that, we do the verse again. So come back and start back over. Second box. Sign, come back and do only this box. Now, after that, I ran out of room on the board. Let me show you what to do next. There are four chords. We're going to do this chord right here. Pay attention. One, two. We're going to do this chord right here. Now, come back to this chord. And then do this chord, and that's the end of lesson one, or part one. Okay? So I uh, barely got it in there, I'm running out of time here, so hope you guys enjoy it.